What's up? My name is Ryan Clifford. I'm a 2022 outfielder and first baseman. Uh, I go to Pro 5 Academy. I'm committed to Vanderbilt, and this is what's in my baseball bag. What's up guys, I'm Hype and I had to jump into this video real quick to ask for a huge favor. I'm trying to reach 25,000 subscribers by the end of the year on this channel. If you are subscribed to the channel, please leave a thumbs up on this video. It's a huge help to growing the channel. All right, so subscribe to the channel, leave a thumbs up. That's it, back to the video. Um, to start out, we'll go with kind of the stuff that's on the outside. I've got a Rawlings uh, Mike Trout model glove here. This was my perfect game All-American glove. Um, I haven't really used Rawlings a lot, but I've been enjoying it a lot. I've got my name here on the side, I've got my number here, and I just got to cut it loose on the side. There's no thumb, I didn't see it on it. He asked, he said, you're sick. Uh, moving into it, I've got a first baseman's mitt here. This is a Wilson glove that I was given from Kane's Baseball, playing with them. Um, I've had this for a little over a year and a half now. And I've, I've enjoyed it a lot. I think the colors go well with our Pro 5 uh, team. Back. Moving on, I've got a, a DeMarie de Voodoo here. This is my metal bat I've used. Um, was searching for one of these for a while and finally uh, picked one up. It's a 34 inch bat. Um, and I've enjoyed this a lot. I've used it uh, all season and I think it's really good leading up to Vanderbilt with them being DeMarini as well. My wood bat here, this is Old Hickory. It's a J143M model, 33 and a half job three. Uh, it's maple wood. I've been using this model since I think I was uh, 13, just kind of going up in size from a 33 to a 33 and a half. Um, I've pretty much always gotten this color. I usually will go with this tan color. I have occasionally had all black, um, but I've, oh, I've Always put pine tar on the logo. That's just kind of a thing I've done. Um, yeah, it's, it's by far my favorite model for wood bats. We'll go inside the bag here. I'm not really sure what's first, but uh, this is a 44 Pro. Uh, just kind of a, a trainer type mitt. Um, I got this a while back, and it's something that I used to warm up, kind of work on hands and transfers and stuff like that. It's got my name on the side here with the 44 logo. I think I got this when there was a nice discount going on for them. Uh, moving into these, these are Bryce Harper turf shoes. Um, I'll usually use these kind of if we're hitting in the cage or something like that. I've had them a, a good amount and they've gotten some wear and tear on them, but um, they've held up really well for me and I definitely enjoy using these to hit in the cage. Uh, we'll go into the turfs next. These are some Adidas. I think they're actually football turfs. Um, playing at Ting Park, we were on turf here, so we have to use some molded spikes. Um, and these have, these have uh, held up for me really well. I think I haven't really seen any difference in using football cleats versus baseball molds and stuff like that. So uh, I'm really happy with the way these turned out. Uh, this is our helmet. These are Team Issue Rawlings helmets. Um, got a little face guard on the side. I've had that pretty much ever since uh, I think Stanton kind of came back with one of those. That was kind of when that, that uh, light switch flipped and everyone started wearing them. So I've done the same. 
Uh, here's uh, a set of all black Evo shield guards I got. These were given to us when we were in Jupiter with the canes. I think these were unreleased at the time. They've got the cool little silver pattern and, and um, the Evo shield logos with them. So I use these a lot with kind of away games um, or anytime we're on a dirt field just because we lead into it. I've got another pair here. These are the white Evo shields. Um, different model here for them, but uh, got these I think right around Christmas time. So I've tried to keep them clean. It hasn't totally worked out for me. Um, but these are more like home games or turf field games where they're not likely getting as dirty from sliding. Uh, the rest of this is kind of a mess. I've got a lot of batting gloves here. So these are some Under Armour Ozzy Albies batting gloves. I think uh, Pro5 Virginia, I think, has a kind of a sponsorship with Under Armour. Um, and that's also kind of linked with Canes a little bit, so they sent us a couple pairs. Uh, I actually have three of those, so I'll take those out as we go. So that's kind of a batting practice pair. That's a pair that I don't want to get too, or that's a pair that I'll put a lot of swings in. And then I've got a, a game pair here uh, and another one as well. So with that, they also sent um, some Cody Bellinger model gloves. These are pretty sweet. They got 35 on it. Um, some red, white, and blue action. I haven't really used these yet. I've just kind of been using the all reds for now, but uh, we'll definitely use these at some point. Um, these are also some just old, old gamer Franklins. Um, I've gone with all red for a while with Pro 5. Uh, that's kind of my rotation. I'll use them I'll, whenever they're brand new. I'll use them in the games for a while and then once they start getting a little older, I'll switch to just put them in, in for VP gloves. I've got a couple pairs of those, so I'll take those out now. Um, I think that's about it. Uh, I've got a bunch of these. These are just some Franklin gloves that were given to us at USA. Um, they got the USA Baseball logo there on them. I think we got these at PDP as well as the Trials. Um, yeah, put a lot of swings into these, especially using them kind of in the hot summer days. Definitely got some wear and tear to them, but they've held up pretty well for me. I think I have a couple more of those I'll take out. Up next, I think these are these are some G-Form gloves. Um, these were a part of Perfect Game All-American as well. Um, I've used these a lot in BP, and they've held up pretty well for me. I uh, haven't tested out if the pad works to get hit in the hand yet, thankfully. Um, but yeah, G4 from All-American. Uh, from a different All-American, this is Baseball Factory. We got some Bruce Bolts here. Um, played with, I think it was the American team for that one, so we were blue. Um, use these more in BP. I don't really use them in games because I don't have blue on my jersey. but. Um, They've been pretty good for me and, and definitely going to consider getting some more Bruce Bolts at some point. Uh, moving on, I got a couple pairs of these Adidas all white batting gloves. These were from East Coast Pro. Um, you know, these were pretty good for me. I know there was one time where I kind of put a little thing on my finger, just kind of hurt a little bit, but once you kind of broke them in, they've been good and um, these have definitely held up really well for me. I've had these since midsummer and, and they're still going strong. Um, after that, I got an Evo Shield sliding mitt. Uh, I've had this for, I think about a year. Um, it's always in my back pocket during games and ready to use it you know, if I reach on base. Um, I got a spare belt here. This is, uh, I don't know what brand it is to be honest with you, but um, total backup in case I bust a belt or um, something happens and I forget it or something like that. Uh, I got a rosin bag in here that I've used. Um, a lot of times if I have a stick pine tar, I'll go with the pine tar rag after and then once that dries up, I'll put some, uh, some rosin on it to help finish that stick for me. And then if our pitchers ever need it, it's always open to them. Uh, I got some more of these Franklin batting gloves. And then I got some spray pine tar here. Um, you know, this is ever if that kind of dries up and I don't have any other pine tar available, uh, I'll use the spray. Uh, 
Uh, let's see, from there I got some bug spray. I know a couple of our fields we played at have been kind of brutal with bugs, and I was glad I put this in here and finally I remembered to use it one day. We were playing out in, I think, like pit or something like that, and it was pretty rough, so gotta have some bug spray. Uh, I got a bag of seeds in here. It's a little tough playing on turf fields. Can't really you know, spit seeds as much. Um, but anytime we're at away games or playing at USA Baseball, uh, got some seeds. I'm always an original guy. I've never been anything but that. So I know I get some hate for that. Uh, I got a pretty worn down pine tar tiger stick here. Um, this usually gets to the bottom of the bag and gets everything out sticky. So uh, probably should put a bag on that. Um, from there, I mean, I got a couple baseballs in here in case I ever needed to throw at a away game, stuff like that. Um, these are another pair of Evo Shield batting gloves I have, all black. These were from Canes. Um, these have held up really well. They're kind of a different texture to them. They're almost like a like a, a mitten kind of glove feel, but you know, I was skeptical at first, but they they've been really good for me as well. Um, from there. Uh, sunscreen, it's a big one for me. I think I have another bottom in here somewhere, yeah. I got really pale skin and I get burnt really easily, so I've always got to have sunscreen on me and protect my skin. Uh, let's see, I got an Oakley case in case for some reason I ever need to take them off and put them somewhere. Um, I've always got that. And then another bottle of pine tar spray in here. Uh, and then from there, these are some of the, the game gloves I have. Uh, these are the ones I try to use in games only for now, just to kind of give myself the, the best feel up there. Got another pair of these Evo Shields. Uh, these are some Japanese brand Zet gloves. We've got a good friend with Pro 5, Jerry Sands. He played out in Japan for a couple of years and uh, just recently retired, so he gave back some gloves. Um, different kind of feel to the palm. They're a little uh, tacky as far as it goes. So um, I've liked those for a while and I've got a couple pairs of those as well. Got some more uh, all red Franklins, game Franklins. Um, trying to keep those for games only for now. Uh, I got a couple more pairs here. These were some USA baseball gloves uh, for when you made the national team. Uh, I think they gave these to the Olympic team as well. That's probably what you saw them wearing during that. Um, got a cool United States logo there, and um, these have worked pretty well for me as well. Uh, moving on, I think that is about it. So we got a couple more Franklin gloves. Uh, this is another pair of Zets. And then this is a game pair of the Adidas gloves from East Coast Pro. Um, looking like it's about it. But yeah, that's, a, that's what's in my baseball bag.